Hello, my lovely friends, it's Margaret, and it's time to talk about Vaultathon. I have a new round of Vaultathon coming up in September, so I am here to give you all of the details that you need to know for round five of Vaultathon, which is going to be focused on Meet the Robinsons. If you are new to my channel, Vaultathon is a readathon that I run where we center each round around an underrated or older Disney movie just to kind of, you know, relive the Disney nostalgia. All of the prompts, the group book, all of that stuff is meant to complement whatever Disney movie we choose. Like I said, round five is going to be focusing around Meet the Robinsons, and if you're interested in what our group book is this time, stick around for a few minutes. This round of Vaultathon will be taking place from September 21st to September 27th, and we will have a, a group movie night and also a live show to discuss both the movie and the book. The group movie night is going to be September 26th at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and you can join in by using the hashtag MTRVaultalong. The live show is currently scheduled for September 27th at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. However, I may change that time depending on the time zone of the co-hosts that I will be picking for this round. Speaking of that, there is a link down in the description box. If you are interested in being a co-host for this round of Vaultathon, go ahead and click that link. Come join me. Let me know why you should be a co-host for Vaultathon. I love bringing new people in every time so that we can kind of have a fresh discussion. If you want to stay up to date on everything of Vaultathon, including reading sprints, any news, meeting your co-hosts, go ahead and make sure you follow the Vaultathon Twitter. I will also have that linked below. As usual, I am going to be giving away one copy of the group book to a lucky viewer so make sure you stick around to the end to see how you can enter in that giveaway with all of that information out of the way let's get into what the prompts are this is the point of the video where i remind you that this is meant to be a low-key readathon the group book fits all four of the book related prompts i want to make sure that people are able to participate without feeling like they have to read a ton of books the first prompt is meet the robinsons and that is to read a book with a family that is a little quirky the second prompt is the future has arrived and that is to read a book where someone travels to the past. The third prompt is Captain Time Travel, and that is to read a book where the main character has to team up with a friend. The fourth prompt is Mini Doris, and that is to read a book that is under 300 pages. The fifth prompt is Lewis's Notebook, and that is to document your readathon in some way. The sixth prompt is Singing Frogs, and that is to try something new with your reading. Something new can be defined however you want it. It could be a new book, a new author, a new series, any, any way you want to define trying something new, maybe you're going to try reading somewhere that you don't usually read or try a different method of reading. Any way that you want to define that is valid. Like it's completely up to your interpretation and I would love to hear what your something new is going to be. Also, like last time, we're going to be doing an optional challenge. Now the goal of this challenge is for people to take a little bit of time during this readathon and educate themselves on an issue that pops up in the movie. This time we're calling it the Keep Moving Forward Challenge and the goal of this challenge is to have people look up articles or videos about fat phobia in media. Just like last round, I will have a video coming out later with my TBR and specific recommendations for each prompt. Our group book for this round is going to be Saving Lucas Gibbs by Marissa De Los Santos and David T. This is about Margaret who comes from a family of time travelers. However, she has been told she is never allowed to time travel. It's like their main number one rule, you're not supposed to time travel even though you can. She's really good at keeping that rule until her dad is wrongfully sent to jail. She decides the best way to fix that is to go back in time and try and make the judge who sentenced her father a better person as a child. Now it is time to talk about the giveaway. Unfortunately, this round, I'm only going to be able to open it up to people in the United States as this is not on book depository, so I have to go through Barnes & Noble or another bookstore and I don't have money for international shipping. I'm sorry, I wish I did. The way that you, the way that you win is you need to follow the vault on Twitter, retweet the announcement tweet, and then come back and comment done down in the description box. Make sure you leave me your Twitter handle so that I can make sure that I'm matching those up because I will check for an extra entry, reply to the announcement tweet, and tell me what part of the past would you like to time travel to? This giveaway is open until 11.59 Eastern Standard Time on August 22nd, and I will be contacting the winner on August 23rd. That, my friends, is everything that you need to know about round five of Vaultathon. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, you might enjoy these videos over here. Check them out. That is it for now, my friends. Happy reading, and I will see you later when we will talk about more wordy, nerdy things. Bye!